so I am back to finally review this um, natural hair oil and this is Essentials by Tyra and I will leave all her contact information down in the description box below so this was sent to me for review such a long time ago and I apologize so much because I kept telling her I would get this review out but when she originally sent this to me I want to say it was either in December or January and so I read it in ingredients on this. This is 100% all natural alcohol free hair oil. So the ingredients are African shea butter, raw, raw coconut, essential oils, olive oil, safflower, safflower oil, castor oil, glycerin, vitamin E, tea tree, avocado, grapefruit, lime, and fragrances. So the smell on this to me it just pretty much smells like coconut oil. I don't really smell any fragrance or anything like that and it's a very light oil so like I said when she first sent this to me she sent it to me in the winter time so as you see it's a very light oil I don't have to squeeze the bottle at all for it to come out and it's like a yellowish tint which I don't think you'll be able to see on camera but it's a very light oil and I've been using it um, as a sealant and a lock method as well as um, kind of like I guess a finisher or to combat frizz when I'm taking down my hair like I used it today to take down this braid out and so it's worked better for me as um, I guess you know as a sealant as a finisher or to help combat frizz I'm not really an oil person on my hair per se but I do like this oil and I find myself picking it up a lot more um, it does um, solidify in colder weather, weather, which is why I was unable to use it when she first sent it to me. And so I've had it since January and a little bit of this goes a very, very long way. And I don't know how well you can see that, but it's still here in the package. And this here is, um, I think it's a four ounce and it retails for, I think $10 if I'm not um, correct I'll list the price here below but I mean it's a very good oil it works well for me it gives me a lot of shine when I do use it I don't have issues with a lot of frizz when I use it as well and usually when I use coconut oil it makes my hair extremely hard which is why I was kind of leery with this but I guess since the shea butter is the first ingredient and that the coconut is second that it made a little bit of a distant difference and also probably because I used it more as a finisher rather than um, applying it on my clean naked hair that also makes a difference so I do recommend this and it is one of the oils that I do keep in rotation and um, I only use one other kind of oil that I absolutely love and that is like the oil for me I had went through Camden Gray and bought about $200 worth of oils and ended up giving them all away because I tried them in my hair and, and my hair does not like really like oil that much so this has been very helpful for me and I enjoyed trying this out if any of you are looking for uh, oils to use in your hair or any kind of oil blend I definitely recommend this it worked really well for me even though my hair has a hate relationship with coconut oil this has done very well with my hair so if you're interested in picking this up, um, her website, I'll leave it right here, but it's tyra.bigcartel.com. And I'll be sure to leave all her information down in the description box below. If you have any questions, leave them down there and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Be blessed.